All right, welcome to the Marathon Eden Zero, the final episode. Woo! So, ladies and gentlemen, six months later, we finally reached the finale. One of the most interesting show for this year, I'll say, for me personally, of course, on a Sunday, where we can say the release schedule because of Netflix prison and stuff there. It's been all over the place. Sometimes reacting in the morning, sometimes reacting in the afternoon. So, sorry about that, guys. I have no fixed schedule for Eden Zero. Sometimes I even skip on the episode because I wasn't feeling it too. So, yeah, blame Netflix for that. But anyhow, you can say I am actually really looking forward to see how we finish today final episode because well you can say this final episode i'm pretty sure based on what i can see from the preview that you know it could be a more of a cool down episode that like you wrap everything up now and prepare for some sort of sequel to come because like i checked quarter before i started the reaction to see whether season two was announced well i don't think there was anything announced last night so i say you know what i don't think there'll be season two but who knows man maybe in the near future they'll announce it like hey hey skimmy sen just really didn't announce the season two not long ago and with the anime finished like last year so yeah you can say i am not sure looking forward to checking out more of Eden Zero in the future maybe just maybe I can will consider picking up the manga because I'm actually really invested in the Eden Zero especially the character design the one thing that sold me for this series is the character design and character engagement it's just so enjoyable to watch man especially the girls of course and well I mean this is my first time ever watching or should I say you know reacting to anything Hero Mashima related stuff I know like you guys asked me man like, so you never watch Fairy Tale, you never watch Rave, Eve, Rave, Eve, Raven or whatever that thing is called again so yeah I know I it came to a surprise of many of you guys that well, I never watched Fairy Tale or should I even really bother like picking up anytime soon. But you can say maybe because I'm thinking doing a Fairy Tale non-season anime reaction next season, a, a poll. I'll make a poll for it and you guys will vote for it, of course. So looking look out for that. So yeah, Fairy Tale. Hopefully I can you know, pick up that soon because I really enjoy Eden Zero. And people told me that those who watch Eden Zero are pretty much Fairy Tale fans anyway, or those who are fans of my Hero Mashima work. So yeah, I'm looking forward to check out more Eden Zero in the near future if we're gonna get a sequel of course so this final episode let's just see is it like a very solid end and of course see whether or not these got teased for a potential sequel maybe because usually in this sort of situation you should be you know it's getting as excited for what to come because i've been told that the you know after what we left off from this arc things get even more darker now i mean i mean things get even more interesting um there is something that you blow your mind away and something like that that's what people have been telling me about that this arc it's just another one of those typical generic arc but the, the arc after this is things get even more well, how to say twisted or something like that. So, with that said, let's check out this fun episode in 3, 2, 1, play! Oh yeah, if I talk weirdly, it's because I have a, a rough nose in the morning. You know, when your nose got blocked, you can't speak properly. <laughs> Yeah, I'm very glad that Homura in the end stabbed a sword on his heart, man. I'm so glad that happened because I hate this asshole. I hope he's dead too. Like, the one thing I like to say, I give credit from Hiro Mashima is that he creates really annoying villains. Like, the villains in this series or any, maybe any of his work, you just want them die, want them dead, so. Oh yeah, I've also been told that Dragon could be this is one of the biggest threat after this arc. So yeah, looking forward to it. Of course, I never. I mean, I, we always saw a bit of his the potential, but I don't not enough to say okay, he's a big threat, something like that. I mean, I heard I've been told that he is like a that like a big bad boss. So oh my god, is he gonna use some sort of ultimate blast or something? Yep, there we go. You mean laser eyes, right? Okay, so can we ha hurry up and defeat her already? Because she's causing disaster. Dude, she deserved death, man. I don't care what happened to her. Just uh, kill her, man. Queen Nova. Oh, there's a fucking... Oh my god, there's a nuke? There's a fucking nuke inside of her the machine? Oh boy. So, let's just see whether she can uh, deflect that bomb or something. I mean, it's a tracker bombs a missile, so. Well, that's good though, because Shiki can fly right at you and the bomb will hit you instead, I guess. Or oh, something. Oh, I can do that, I guess. Yeah, something like that, I guess. No, I don't think so. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> wow. I mean, can you can you just like launch into like the robot and then let it hit her or something? Uh, oh, now you come up with the idea. <laughs> wow, I could have done that earlier, man. Mm. Mm hmm. 
Right, okay. Mm hmm. Oh, is he actually gonna break in or something? He's actually gonna break in? Oh, yo, wow, Shiki. Yo, are you gonna throw it at her or something? Uh, he's actually gonna throw it, isn't he? Yeah! Oh, oh, never mind. He's actually gonna use it as a booster to break the window. Okay. I mean, of course he can. He's a he's a gravity user. What do you expect? Hey, finally. Took you long enough. Gravity impact. Oh, of course. You do the typical like um, you know, super grand word. Oh. Yes, there we go, Shiki. There we go. I like how you think outside the box in the situation too, so Nice one, Shiki. And now you, well, you come with me. You come with me. Oh, I love the, I love the image, the, the fading of the shadows over that. Oh my god, that that for that shadowing effect, man. <laughs> you come with me. We are going to see Homura. Mhm. Mm they stop functioning. Yep. Oh, so he shut it down. Oh, thanks, Nino. Lamau, so he turns sides. Wow, okay, that was easy. <laughs> I mean, if it's for enemy's sake, he would do anything for it, I guess. Mm-hmm. I mean, even if you join the fight, you won't be in a good condition to fight, so it's... F I'm glad that, you know, the, the villain cat gave her a wake-up call. Mm. Hey, hey, there we go. Oh, -ho -ho. Let's go, guys. The uh, mom and daughter reunion. Mom and daughter reunion. Mm-hmm. You actually look at it though. They really do look, look like that though. It's just that Homer has more tan than her. And let me guess you can say no, let Homer do it or something. I mean feel free to rape her if you want. I told you. I told you. I told you. Of course. It's typical plot point, man. Typical plot point. Shiki wants Homura to make the final decision. I mean, you know, it's her mom biologically, so yeah. Mm hmm. And also, of course, this is Homura's way of avenging Valkyrie too, I guess. Mm hmm. I mean, I, I'm glad they support the decision, I guess. Mm -hmm. Uh, Homer, whatever decision you do, make sure you just make it suffer, man. So it's all down to Homer. You are the decision maker. Your jury. Your judge, jury, and executioner, basically, right now. <laughs> Look at the eyes, man. This is my mom. Are you kidding me? I mean, you can just tell from her eyes, man. Homer, just, just, just kill her, man. She's toying with you, man. She never cared about you. Dude, there's no feelings behind those words, man. You don't feel anything from it. Um, okay. Oh, is she returning? Oh, she's returning the doll that mom gave. That she kind of shows that she's now going to distance away from her parent. It's the same concept from the Shazam. If you watch Shazam, it's like that sort of concept. That way it returns something that, you know, connects to the family. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
Oh, go ahead, girl. Go ahead, girl. Mm hmm. Go ahead, girl. Mm hmm. Kill her, man. Mm hmm. Yeah, exactly, right? Just show her no mercy. And I guess you did not kill her. Oh, yeah, knew it. I mean, what she can, though. She's her lesson in life. Don't kill people. <laughs> hmm, what? Okay. I have no interest in you. Okay, I mean, that's fair enough, I guess. Mm hmm Oh, wow. I have nothing besides giving birth to me. Thanks for everything. That you've done nothing to me. Mm hmm Valkyrie's the mom. He's the mom that she respects it more. Mm hmm Yes. Tell her, man. Tell her, man. Tell this bitch. How much do you do? You, you're nothing to her now. Mm hmm. I gotta say, she's really developed for that age, too, man. Was more of a mom to me. Mm hmm. I mean, these guys spent like 10 years together, so of course. Mm hmm. So basically she say, shoo shoo, I want nothing to do with you anymore. Oh, yo, that eye, man. Oh my god. Stay away from me forever. Don't get near me again. If I, if I see you again, I'll kill you for sure. That's what she's saying. That's what I can tell from those eyes, man. That is just pure menace, man. So run, shoo shoo, bye bye. I mean, of course, she's gonna be targeted by more people, I guess. Like, Homer, like, tells to go away so that other people can deal with her themselves, I guess. <laughs> told you. Ah! Ha ha ha! Told you. Told you. Told you. Just because Homer let you go doesn't mean you're safe, okay? There are, there are more enemies coming after you. Wait, isn't he the one got his face disoriented by her or something? Yep, I knew it. Knew it. Knew it. Mm hmm. Well, I guess they're gonna rape her, I guess. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, man. That was so satisfying to see, man. That was just so satisfying. Mm hmm. Oh, now, now she had the face of Homer. The... Oh boy. Yep, there we go. Oh! Ho, 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 ho. Yeah, I told you. Just because Homer let you go doesn't mean you're safe. Okay, so... Mm -hmm. I mean, if she's a robot though, can't they bring it back to the ship and repair her or something? My mom? Yep, there we go. I mean, I think the mom is more of a, in a nutshell, so it applies to her more. So I'm glad that she let her, like, you know, rest in peace. So I guess that's Homer's, you know, size the story done now. So, I mean, yeah, I guess Homer's story is now done. So I guess the plan is now a treasure hunting spot. Okay. Mm hmm. I mean, they have to. 
Oh yeah. Oh and there we go. The reaction. And of course, she had to say, bring that up, man. She have to bring that up because she can fix her. Mm -hmm. Oh, so she's like a shrine. Okay. Shrine of hope. And she's not happy about it. Mm -hmm. That's not the point, man. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm hmm. I mean, that sounds too convenient, though. Oh. Oh, really? So it won't be that easy. Oh, okay. Oh. So she doesn't have the sort of like the love feeling. I mean, yeah, that kind of makes sense though. She's wow, part for emergency fixing only. Wow, but only emergency fixing, but not death. Of course, everything lies with Shiki, man. Everything goes to Shiki's decision. <laughs> She's gonna catch on with it. Endor station. <laughs> Endor station. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? <laughs> so basically, when someone died, just let him die. I think that's what he's trying to say. It's on his flashback. So basically, you just let them die in peace. Don't let them suffer. <laughs> yeah, that's true, though. Um, I mean, wise words, man. Very wise words from Shiki. Very unusual. <laughs> mm hmm. Really? Wait, does it have to be a robot? Wait, she's not a robot though, so... Is there, is, is there like a... Yeah, exactly, the non-android, we have four shiny star. Oh, so there's no room for it. Really, you want to be one? I mean, Homer technically have Valkyrie skills though, but not at the best. But she still has it though, so... So she was willing to carry the mission then. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, okay. Pretty well then. So basically, Homer is willing to carry on Le Valkyrie legacy then. Mm hmm. So it doesn't have to be a robot to be a, a shining star, huh? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just call home run, man. Rad bit. Just call home run, man. Why have to call Valkyrie? Oh <laughs> Valkyrie. What? What's that? <laughs> yeah, just home run, man. Yeah, just go home run, man. Yeah, exactly. Why did goes to complication to give her a new name? Dude, do you think Moscow has the potential? <laughs> of course.
They're only interested. Hey, she's still here. Well, I mean, of course, they'll be excited for her for her to wear Valkyrie's, you know, outfit. Yeah, I've been told that he's the next big boss there to deal with in a, after this arc, so... Yeah, I, I want to wonder where we get Season 2 is in the future. Mm -hmm. Oh... They're still many, uh, remembering Valkyrie through this. Mm hmm I mean, they were sisters for a long time, so yeah. Oh, she's crying? Oh, ho, 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 ho. she was holding back. Oh, man. Oh, man, she was holding back. Oh. Damn. Hmm. The robot do have emotions. Well, I mean, it's best to let out those emotions than holding it in, man. Holding it in just gonna kill you, hurt you a lot more. So I'm glad they let out their feelings. It's just the beginning, huh? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Wow, seems like, uh, you know, a lovely narrator is giving us a, a hint what to expect. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. So, time to read the manga, I guess? <laughs> Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mother, where else? The grand prize, everyone. The grand prize is mother. Aha, there she is. Wait, she spoke. Oh, hey. Hey. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. I swear to God, if she turns out to be Mother's creation, then I'm like, I'm done, man. If this plot twist turns out to be true, then, bruh. Next. Oh, no way. Yo, next, yo, what? Wow! Oh, no! What? What's going on here? Holy sh! What? No! No! Wait! What's going on? What? I thought he's dead! Wait, what's going on? Holy shit! Yo! Wait, 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 hold the phone, hold the phone. What the fuck just happened? What was that ending? No way. Is that, is that some sort of like preview to the next arc or something? Oh my god. Yo. What? Rebecca Leaper Power just, uh, just exploded or something? Like, what the fuck? Wait, the. 
The demon lord is alive? I thought he's dead. Oh my god, what the fuck is going on? And Dragon is like... Did Dragon just shot Shiki on the head? What the hell? And what the hell was Homer wearing? Oh my god, yo. Oh my god, Eden Zero is be under the attack too. And we saw some sort of Fantastic Four. Uh, yeah, I guess these are indeed the uh, next villain they to deal with in the next arc, I guess. OMG. What the fuck, man? Seriously. I, oh my god. It literally said next. So is, is that a way to tease us and say that, oh yeah, we're going to get season two, but we don't know when we get season two. Oh my god, yo. Okay. So it's kind of confirmed we're going to get season two in the future, I guess. So looking forward to it. I mean, who knows, man? Where is it coming out? I mean, obviously Netflix need to release all of the episodes on, on their website worldwide, of course, first. So yeah. I think if we're going to get season two, it will be most likely be maybe sometime late next year or maybe early 2023. But okay, I am interested now. I mean, maybe I should put off on reading the manga for the time being again. So, okay. So what happened there? Just, what, what, so Dragon got the better of Eden Zero or something? Maybe Dragon team was a bit too much for them to handle. And that's why, you know, you saw that situation where Shiki was being held hostage and she got shot in the head or something. And then we get to see the Demon Lord awakening. Like, what the hell is going on, man? Oh my god, yo. I've been told by many of you guys that this arc, that this season one is more like a uh, you know world building arc. And then the, after this is more where things really get more serious now. Like, everything, you know, focusing more on the sort of like dealing with the bigger villain like Dragon. Dragon is like one of the biggest villains they had to deal with. The, the first biggest villain they had to deal with and stuff like that. So, okay. Don't tell me the, the Demon Lord in the end is going to be a villain or something, but... Oh, dude, I am excited for Season 2, man. Because Season 1, though, I gotta say... There are some episodes that were good. There are some episodes that was laid back. There are some episodes that was like, say, was it really worth it, though? So, I'm pretty much going to give this Season 7 out of 10. I mean, it's a good score, by the way, for a show that is just trying to build up the world for us to enjoy. I mean, I'm pretty, I mean, season two comes, I think it will be like more of the anime of the season potential, maybe. But if it's not a Netflix creation, that is. So, yeah, I'll be looking forward to season two in the near future. But my God, man, what a way to tease us for the upcoming sequel, man. Oh, my God. This final episode, like I said, guys, is more like a closing chapter episode. You know, just see how they move on from Valkyrie. And, you know, they go embark on a new adventure, basically fight Dragon next, I guess. So, oh, my God. Good, good show, by the way. Good, Eden Zero is a very enjoyable show this season. Hope I get to see season two very soon. And of course, look out for Fairy Tale poll rating. I need to see whether you guys want me to react to Fairy Tale or another show. So, looking forward to that for next episode for in the future, of course. So, with that said, hope you guys enjoy my reactions. Smash the like button, and I'll see you guys next time.